Oh. Oh. Oh my god. I was split to hell. Yo, what's going on guys? It is Riley and welcome back to the channel. And today's video is I'm gonna be giving you guys my updated 2022 Black Ops Cold War settings. The settings I'm gonna be sharing with you guys are the absolute best for FPS and visibility while you're playing multiplayer in Cold War. You're gonna want these settings to put yourself at the biggest advantage possible while playing multiplayer. So without further ado, let's jump right into it. We're gonna be starting it off in the keyboard and mouse tab, guys. As most of you know, I do play keyboard and mouse. I am a K-Band player and my mouse sensitivity Activity in game is five and my DPI is a thousand and the mouse I use and strongly strongly recommend is the Logitech G Pro super light I just got this mouse about a month ago and it's by far my favorite mouse best mouse I've ever had it's super nice wireless it holds a charge very well and it doesn't take long to charge at all so I would really recommend this mouse so yeah, if you guys want to pause the video at any point in time to copy down some of these settings, I'm not going to be going over every single setting just because I feel like that would make the video a little bit too long. But if you want to get any of these settings, like I said, just pause the video. All right, guys, here we are in the graphics tab. I'm going to be focusing on two settings that are going to really affect your FPS when you're playing Cold War. And the first one here is render resolution. You're going to want to keep this at 100. The higher you go, the better your game will look. But the better your game looks the more frames you sacrifice so personally i think 100 render res is absolutely perfect the happy medium between good frames and the game looking good so we're gonna scroll on down here you guys can pause none of these settings are really gonna affect your frames too much if you don't like how your textures on your gun look you can always turn these up i personally like them on medium if i'm trying to get a picture of a thumbnail or something i'll turn them up too high or sometimes ultra but i think medium is very nice for the texture and model quality all these you're going to want to copy them exactly the same and coming up we have another big fps impact setting we have the anti-aliasing quality so if you guys have your anti-aliasing quality all the way cranked up you're going to get absolutely horrible frames so you're going to want to turn this down i have it on lowest because i'm willing to sacrifice how the game looks for more frames guys this is kind of personal preference, but I would recommend having it on lowest. If anything, put it on medium or low, but I would try to avoid high or ultra to be completely honest with you guys. You're going to want DLSS off, disabled, motion blur disabled always. You're going to want to turn all this off. And I don't think this setting really matters. I just have it on high. I'm going to run through the graphics settings one more time. I'm just going to go slow, pause if you need to, but these are the best graphic settings on cold war you guys want to have high frames you want to be able to see more of the game and you'll be able to play better if you can see more so make sure you guys copy these settings 
let me know what you think in the comments or if you have any questions or any video ideas pretty much anything leave a comment for your boy and i'll get back to you and yeah guys that's gonna be it for the video i'm gonna put some more sniping highlights obviously using these settings at the end of the video so if you guys are new please subscribe if you enjoyed the video slap a like on it helps your boy out a ton and i will catch you guys hopefully in the twitch streams and if not i'll see you in the next video take care everybody in 2022 that bit'll be good or like using the ZRG in 2022, like that would be good. Or like switching it up like that. I'm so sorry. How many was that? Put six on. Wow. Mr. Fancy Pants. Oh my god. Let me go. Ooh. Oh, that's so sad. Oh. Nah, Clyde ending 5 on, but it was split. Oh my god. They're all back though.